What's happening, Panda Nation? Peter Von Panda here. If you're comparing wireless chargers, you definitely want to check out this video. I wanted to compare and contrast some wireless chargers for any phone, iPhone, Samsung, Android devices. And what I have here are three wireless chargers that I've shown you over the past few weeks here. And one of the things that I wanted to do here is just compare them and contrast them a little bit because I have been really, really surprised about them. And I wanna give you my final thoughts and my reveal at the end. So first of all, we have a few different chargers. Now I can't remember uh, exactly which ones these are, but this one is the Samsung one. This one is by Xiaomi, I believe. And this one is by Bazaar Dodo. Interesting name. And first of all, I want to show you this Samsung one is pretty ubiquitous. It's plastic. It's got a little uh, rubber ring right there. You can see how UFO saucer shaped it is. It's pretty thick. Runs on a USB-C plug right there. And, you know, it's not that big. It's about the size of a regular cup coaster. This one is quite a bit bigger. In fact, if you put them on there, you can see how much bigger it is. The Xiaomi one is really nice. The whole top here is rubberized so things don't slip off of it, but you can see just how massive this sucker is. It's got nice weight to it too, even though it is um, generally plastic construction. You can see actually it vents out the bottom here and then type C uh, right there too. So you need a cord. There's a little LED right there, but all of these work pretty well. You know, the nice thing about this is that uh, that rubber holds it in place because this one is much larger, you know, even with any type of case that you might have on there this one is a little grippier now i want to show you this bizarre dodo one because relative to these other ones this one is so much thinner first of all it's got nice weight to it despite how thin it is because this whole uh piece right here this this base plate is metal with some rubber feet on it but look how thin that is i mean just look at that it's not even in the same ballpark right you can see those uh even though this one is generally kind of thin the Bizarre Dodo one is crazy thin. And on top of that, it's not that big. It's actually about the size of the smaller one. And so footprint wise, it's it's uh, very easy to manage. You can put it on your desk and whatnot. Now, the other thing I really love about it is that you have this really thin nylon braided or covered cable right there, and it's already attached. So there's a permanent cable that goes to a regular type A, USB type A plug. And so you don't need a separate plug for this. You're not robbing your cord box for one of those USB-C cables. And this beautiful like glass type uh, top portion, maybe it's polycarbonate, it shows fingerprints a little bit, but it's just really, really beautiful and nice and slick. Now, of course, you might be saying, well, looks aren't everything, Pete, does it actually work? So if I just throw it on there, you can see that it works fantastically. And that's really what I have come to enjoy about this because you know, this type of thing I can put on any desk, any nightstand, I can put it in my guest rooms, I can put it in my office, put my stuff on it, and it's just so small and slim, it doesn't take up a lot of real estate and looks great. It looks the business as well. The other thing is this thing is way cheaper than these. And so, you know, this is like 30 bucks and this is like 28 bucks. This is, I think, for like $14. And so given the fact that it looks great, is super small and super slim and is half the price of these. The big reveal here is that I went on the website and ordered another one because I love it so much. So if you wanna pick up this Bizarre Dodo wireless charging pad, I will put a link to it in the description below. Peter Von Panda, out.